Hi everybody, Thomas Eves with the Eves Realty Group at Keller Williams Realty. Standing Now, the last time I spoke to you guys, I mentioned that my favorite listing of all time was 6745 Country Club Drive in Dallas. I lied. Uh, again, my favorite listing actually is 102 Cliffbrook Drive in Wiley, Texas, which is conveniently right behind me. So I'm going to take you inside. This is a three bedroom, two bath, 2,057 square feet in Wiley, Texas. Now, the first thing that you're going to notice about this property, why can't I change the camera? I never remember how to do that. The first thing that you'll uh, notice about this, oh, I found it. First thing you'll notice about this property is the front porch area here, which is perfect for uh, staring at your neighbors driving by who are going to be very, very jealous of uh, just how much nicer your house is than theirs. Now, look at this. Now, notice the uh, the beautiful stone facade on the front of this house. Now, there's, there's nothing else like that's that that's brick brick all nice they're nice don't get me wrong they're very nice but they're not quite as nice as yours is the point uh, so now we're gonna walk up to the front door here and uh, here is the ring doorbell where the owners of this home are undoubtedly watching me talk to myself now the first thing you're gonna notice whenever you walk into this house is the gleaming beautiful light bright bamboo wood floors now, uh, the 1990 saw, uh, 1999 song uh, All Star by Smash Mouth said, All that glitters is gold. The band members had not seen the floors of this house yet. So that song is actually going to be amended to say, All that glitters is gold and the floors of 102 Cliffbrook Drive in uh, Wiley, Texas. The next thing you'll notice is uh, just the brilliant architectural features of this home. Look at the archways. That is not cheap. That is luxury. And if you look even closer, you'll notice all the corners of this house are bullnosed or uh, rounded corners. So you think that dogs and kids are going to run through the place and mess up the corners of the house, scratch the paint? No, not possible. Not going to happen. Next thing you'll notice, we're going to walk straight into the kitchen. HGTV informed me that kitchens and bathrooms are what sell houses. So I'm going to go straight into the kitchen. We're not going to waste any time here. So uh, you'll notice uh, this kitchen has uh, pretty much everything. It's got the uh, granite tile counters. It's got stainless steel appliances. Look at how much cabinet space this place has. And uh, go straight into the living area here, open floor plan. The uh, tile is imported Italian tile. You can tell because it has a very thick accent. Now, if you've watched any uh, HGTV over the past several years, you'll notice that a huge trend is the barn doors. Look at this. This is cool. And this is custom. This is handmade. And so what's really cool, these owners were very smart. They've got the barn door, but they also left the original door, which is convenient because on the other side of this door is the laundry room. So you've got full-size washer and dryer stacked there, and then you've got this huge built-in area for all of your uh, stuff. So that's convenient as well. So we've got the uh, breakfast area here, and we're gonna walk straight across and go out to the, uh, the outdoor living area here. Huge covered space here that goes out into the backyard. Now here's what's really, really cool about this house. It's really, really convenient for like a zombie apocalypse uh, because if you were in one of those situations, you'd want uh, some food source. Well, look at this. In your very own backyard, apples, you can pick right off the tree and eat pears over here, something in the middle that the homeowner told me about that I've already forgotten about. Uh, but the point is you have fruit bearing trees in your very own yard, which is great. We're going to go back into the house here where it's not 115 degrees. Um, thanks to the high efficiency 16 sear air conditioning system. So uh, the next thing I'm going to show you is uh, this house has a true split bedroom formation. Here's what I mean by that. I'm standing here in the open area of the house. Over there is the master bedroom, okay? Way over here, several, several miles away, is the, uh, the secondary bedrooms of the house. So if we go this way, so you'll see bedroom to the left, bedroom to the right, bathroom in the middle. You'll notice the bamboo floor goes throughout the secondary bedrooms as well. Uh, floor molding has uh, north-facing windows, so these are fabulous bedrooms for sleeping in because uh, you never get any direct sunlight through the north-facing windows. Both the bedrooms virtually the same size, same features. This is the, uh, the full bath in the middle of the house. Has this really, really cool mirror that I'm told is extremely heavy and therefore it will be staying here. Okay, now we're gonna make our way through the cavernous living room into the, uh, the master bedroom. Now I'll tell you, I've listed a lot of houses. I've not listed one with a master bedroom quite this large. So here it is, huge master bedroom. Look at this. It just keeps going and going and going and actually has access to outdoors as well. Look at how big this is. You could actually put two uh, king size beds in here if you were so inclined. Uh, so that goes into an even cooler master bathroom. Ugh, 
God, it keeps happening. So uh, master bathroom has garden tub, separate shower, dual basins, water closet, and you just have to take my word for this one, has a walk-in closet as well. So that's it. That is 102 Cliffbrook Drive in Wiley, Texas, the greatest listing on the face of planet Earth, my favorite listing I've ever taken. Uh, it's priced it uh, very fairly at $275,000, 2,057 square feet, three bedroom, two bath. If you know someone who would be interested in this house, or if you're interested in this house, message us, share this video, let us know, or come to one of our open houses. We're doing one every weekend until this sucker sells. So uh, again, Thomas Eves with the Eves Realty Group at Keller Williams Realty. Bye, y'all.